Hey guys, Reno here. Welcome back to I the Somnium Files. In the last episode, we investigated this place, so if you want to know what happened there, definitely go and check out the last, last episode if you missed it. Now we've got three places to go, and I'm thinking I want to go to go see Mama first. It's about time we got some of those fridge jokes going, I think. If that's what happens in this world. But of course, we've got to drive down the middle lane of the road first, because it's the only lane Darty can drive in. Or on the left lane, if there is one. And it's what a way to spend your Sundays, eh? I mean, go to get pissed drunk is a pretty good way to spend Sunday. Is this it? This yeah. is it. You know about Mama. this place? Yeah, this is where I met Renshu for the first time. Interesting. Didn't think this was your kind of spot. What's that supposed to mean? This place is special. You can find all sorts of shady characters here. It's the best place for gathering information about a case. So that's why. Of course. That is only a partial truth. Shut up. Huh? Let's head inside. Is Mama gonna be here? I hope so. Has she got her fish thing that she's polishing again? Where is everyone? Good question. It's been like this for a while. Not many people come here anymore. Mama should be here soon, though. Okay. Nice purple radio. In other news. Uh -huh. At 6.10 p.m. yesterday, on the outer circle of the Capital City Highway in Minato District, Tokyo, a traffic collision occurred involving five cars and at least one truck. Uh-oh. MPD has arrested the driver of the truck suspected to be the cause of the accident for negligence. Okay. The investigation is ongoing. Right. Good to know. No one is safe. Alright, Mizuki. It's been a long time since we did anything. Did what? Went out somewhere. We sat at a table together like this. We haven't eaten dinner together in a while. After I finish working on this case, we should do it again. Why? Because of what happened to my mom and daddy? I don't need that. Really? Going there with this? Date, this is where you need to take a stronger role as her guardian. Data suggests that children who eat alone are prone to mental imbalances and poor physical condition. The meals you prepare do have sufficient nutritional content. Right. However, you need to make sure that Mizuki is eating all of it. Otherwise, your effort is wasted. You need to be better. Let's get out of I told you, I don't want to. Come on, Mizuki. Why not? Because... Um, I don't like how you hold chopsticks. It makes me sick. <laughs> What's wrong with it? Really, no. People have always told me that I have good technique. Some even say it's beautiful. Who says that? It's disgusting. Too clean. Besides, on, there's Mizuki. no point in eating together. Why not? Why is that? Because you don't talk when you're eating. I don't like sitting in silence. Well, we don't have to be quiet. It's fine, I don't like hearing you talk either. <laughs> oh, come on, Mizuki. I believe she has entered her teenage rebellion phase a year early. I thought she'd grow out of that. Oh, this is gonna be rough. How's school going? It's okay. Is it? Yup. Do you have a lot of friends? Do you have any friends? Yeah. Okay, good, but good. I don't really like my elementary school friends. They're too immature. I have more fun with Iris and Ota. Fair enough. I don't know if they're too immature. You're just very mature for your age. You think so? You seem to be, the yeah. Kids at school are so stupid. They gossip about who had their first kiss for days. Damn. Not you then. I don't see why that's anyone's business. These grade schoolers move fast. Nah, not really. It's pretty normal nowadays. Well, you. You haven't kissed anyone yet, have you? Have you? No, I'm not interested in that. Ah. Oh, thank God. There's the fridge. 
Hey, Mizuki, you mind cleaning some of your stuff out of the fridge at home? Not gonna happen. Why not? Eat it, then. Hey, Date. What did you and Daddy used to talk about when you were here? A lot. Hmm. I don't remember a lot of it. I was usually drinking pretty hard. Fair enough. Don't worry. I have everything recorded. In fact, the conversation about you taking care of Mizuki took place here, at Marble. Huh. Really? The topic was brought up several times afterward, but the first time was here. Four years ago, after drinking enough liquid courage, Renju asked you to take care of Mizuki. At the time, Renju was recently divorced, buried in work at Lemnisgate, and mentally unstable. And nothing changed. It was a display of excellent judgment. It was a good thing that he managed to swallow his pride. You think so? Sometimes, I don't think it was the right move. You should have more confidence. I guarantee you that it was the best decision. Let's hope so. Is Mama here? That Mama? Dante, hey, honey. Hey, Mama. Long time no see. Hey, Mama. How have you been? Oh, tired and sore, but not in a fun way. Oh. <laughs> Watch That's the a innuendo in front of the kid. Oh, who is this? Renju's daughter. Hi, nice to meet you. He's only a bit concerned about that. Oh, you're. I. Oh, it must have been hard. I saw on the news. It's okay. Really. She's shrunk. Oh, it must have been so hard. It's okay, Mama. Stupid Ren. What was he thinking, leaving his little girl like this? <laughs> Mama, do you need... Do you need a drink, Mama? Is that where this is going? Hey, Mama. I wanted to ask you some questions about Renju. Oh, I guess crying isn't going to solve the thing, is it? It ain't, Mama. Go Not ahead. Today. Ask away. I'll help any way I can. Thank you, Mama. Can I get a screenshot out of this? Nah, too far apart. So how's the business going? Not bad. Hey, that's good. I want you to keep this place open as long as you can. It makes me feel sad and old when a place I used to visit closes down. Well then, you should visit more often. We should. I could hook you up, in more ways than one. <laughs> Just the one hey. way is fine, thanks. How's the fridge now? Oh, Mama. What are you doing back there? <laughs> Excuse you! <laughs> yeah, I mean, at some fish pocket they served alcohol, but... I've never been to a bar like this. Okay. Well, I would hope not. You're in elementary school. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, Daddy invited me along sometimes, but I was too shy to go. Good call. I was planning on going one day. Yeah. When I was old enough to drink. Fair enough. I wanted to go to a bar with Daddy. I don't know what the drinking age is in Japan, but if we're 18, we can do it in six years, Mizuki. Not really. I don't know what that said, because the thing covered it. Oh, don't worry, honey. I don't bite. I'm only aggressive not. when it comes to men 20 through mm, 65. <laughs> Fair enough, Mama. That's a pretty wide range. Why not? Gotta widen my net for a catch like you, Date, honey. Fair enough. <laughs> and Mizuki is terrified. I think I'll <laughs> ignore that one. I think I'll ignore it as well. And hopefully Mizuki ignored it as well. I heard that shady characters hang out here. We do. So who are you and how do you fit in? Well, I'm a cop. No one special. I'm just a facilitator. A facilitator? People who come in here tend to have very specific interests. I help accommodate. Like what? Oh. Okay. Is it going there again? Mama's like, uh, an informant. That's right. And I won't charge you this time. This time. Just promise to get the bastards who did this to Ren for me. 
We will. I promise. Good one, Dante. I'm guessing you're the regular? I haven't seen him for a while. Oh. I thought I was going to shrivel up and die of boredom without you boys around. Shrivel up? You look like a purple water balloon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's right. Care to give me a poke? Oh. I'll pass, thanks. Have you heard any rumors about Renju? Anything about grudges, disputes? Is it okay to talk in front of Mizuki? Yes, I want to be here. Okay, it's all good. Trust me, you couldn't drag her away. Not with her ninja skills, he couldn't. If you say so. Apparently, Ren had some connections with the Kumakura gang. Oh, it comes back to them again. A gang? Yeah, real rough customers. This is their turf. So Daddy was involved with gangsters. He was. Sorry, Mizuki. Mizuki, that company Shoko was running, were they also tied to the Kumakuras? Probably. I don't know. Most likely. Hmm. Anything else about Renji and Mama? Well, there was the watch incident. The watch? I'm sure you remember that one. Oh, is this that one where we spilled it on the watch? Incident? You don't remember? Oh, is it that one? Your drunk ass spilled your beer on Ren's watch. Oh, that one, yes. Ren was furious, yelling about how this watch is more important than my life, or whatever. So why did it come he from this time? on you. That was the only time I've ever seen Ren that mad. That's why I remember it so well. Was it this watch? Pulled the watch out. It was the one that I found in the old drum at Sunfish Pocket. Yeah, that's it. Why do you have it? Long story, Mama. Was it at the scene? Yeah. Ren was given that watch by his lover. Oh. It was an anniversary gift, I think. Lover? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot Mizuki was here. It's too late now. No, it's fine. Uh, but of course, it wasn't an affair. This was all after he was divorced. Good, good, good. Daddy had a new lover. He did. Renju really wasn't the uh, the best of dads now, was he? Anything else there, Mama? You remember where it is. I hope so. Yeah, outside, right? This is a small establishment that does not have its own restrooms. Wait, you're leaving? Oh, <laughs> scared of me, huh? Mama and Mizuki alone? Is that a good idea? No, it's just... um... Just... Mama, keep an eye on her. Sure thing. Don't have too much fun in there. Oh, I won't. I gave her a nod and a wave and left. Iba, get boss on the line. Got it. Hey, What's boss. Up? Mizuki is at a bar called Marble down in Golden Yokocho. Send someone over to pick her up. Not at the hospital? Nope. Uh, yeah, she snuck out. I took her along while I was doing some work, but I can't take her any further. Understood. I'll send someone. Thanks, boss. Counting on you, boss. Are Mizuki's you going gonna... to leave Mizuki here? Yes. With Mama? I can't take her into a Yakuza den. She's going to be so mad at me later for ditching her. But to the Kamakura as we go. Epic fight scene? Again? Can we do it twice? Who's this asshole? You made a big mistake coming here. 
Go home. All right. Bye then. Hey, Date. Yeah. What? Ugh, I hate dealing with these chumps. Didn't you hear me? Do you want to die, old man? Damn, epic fight scene. Punches. Epic kick. And the birds. The birds of confusion. Don't even Sorry think about it, Mama. I'm with the MPD. A cop, huh? So, you want to explain what the fuck a cop is doing in my office? I think we should exchange names before exchanging expletives. Name's Moma, the warhorse. Don't give a fuck what your name is. All right, Moma. I have a few things I want to ask you. Yeah. What do you know about the new Cyclops serial killings? Shoko Nadami and Renju Okiura had their left eye pulled out and were murdered. And I think you know something about it. Saw it on the news. Yeah. But we had nothing to do with it. Of course he did. Even if we did, we wouldn't spill to no cops. By the mama. The chairman? <laughs> what? Oh, was that you? The chairman is right in front of you. What? I still him in this line, okay. I run the Kumakura gang. I'm Moma Kumakura. That can't be right. The chairman of the Kumakuras is Rohan. Huh? Not anymore? You aren't the chairman. Yo, asshole! You need a lesson in manners? Says you. Date, wait. I did some research and discovered that Rohan Kumakura died last year. Oh, still. He leapt to his death from the roof of a building. Still. Suicide. But MoMA did not take over last year. MoMA took over six years ago. Six years ago, six of years course. Ago. Anyway, MoMA. You don't know nothing about her. You don't? I know her face and her name. It was on the news. Nothing else. Shoko was part of an investment fraud scheme. She was. And I have it on good authority that a certain Yakuza gang was helping her. Wouldn't know nothing about that, cop. Of course you wouldn't, Mama. Well, Renju. I told you, I got nothing to say. You deaf or something? Date, a minute, please. Yeah? What is it? Do you see the sofa in the reception area? Yeah. There's an ashtray on top of the coffee table. There is. What about it? It is peculiar. Why is it? Thermal imaging reveals that they are both warm. So? The sofa and ashtray. Oh. Wait a minute. The ashtray. Thermal. Siggy is warm. Hey, Iba. Can you turn off the thermal vision? Sure. What about it? I see. The cigarette brand is Klein. Calvin Klein! Why is that relevant? Small details will come in useful later. Trust me. Hmm. And the sulfur? Thermo the sofa. Warm sulfur. The cushion is still red. I thought. Yeah? So then, Moma. What are you talking about? You're the first guest today. Are we? Although you are an uninvited guest. Don't lie now. Someone was sitting on the sofa and smoking very recently. How do you know that? I just do. Oh, right. I remember now. Just a bit ago, one of our guys was on the sofa. Okay. Are you talking about these guys right here? Yeah. Not possible. When I came in... You made a big mistake coming here. Go home. They're both on the, the uh, desk. Who's this asshole? Neither of them was on the sofa. And neither of them was smoking. They left. Oh, so you're spilling the Who beans. Who left? Who? Uh, an insurance salesman. Why was he here? 
right before you came in. I don't think so. Neither do I. I didn't pass by anyone on my way here. So where are they hiding? And I happen to know this office only has one entrance and one exit. Which means, whoever it is... Is still here. They're still in this office somewhere. Let me check the back. Why you want to do that? To find whoever it was? Just wanted to say hello to our guest. I'm telling you, you're the only one here. But we're not. Oh, then you won't mind me checking. Just get out of here, cop. There must be someone they don't want us to see. Who is it? Somewhere behind that wall. Behind the wall? Why is so here? Just as I thought. This must be whoever was sitting on the sofa and smoking room here. My evolver can shoot right through this wall. Come here. I should shoot him. <laughs> Wait! Hmm. Is he not getting enough? What? Never mind. The person behind the wall is unarmed. I cannot approve the use of evolver in this situation. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, shoddy time. Oh, don't say behind you. Oh, we're going super iris. Bullet wounds, shooting. Epic fight scene again. Dante, a porno bag at your feet. <laughs> what? There is? Shots fired. <laughs> of course that worked for Dante. Hey, did you just shoot at me? And you're realizing that now? Okay, minigun. Hey, well, wait a minute. Where did that come from? Damn it, you're a terrible shot. Where are we shooting this time? We're shooting the dragon. Without the dragon ball. Date, load evolver with explosive rounds. Aim for the dragon's gold ball on the right. The what? Oh, that. Okay. Why? Just do it! Explosive round time. There we go, that's a lot of rounds, that's a lot of rounds. That is, that's the explosive one. Explosive round. Not multiple rounds, just singular round. One round. We've got one shot. Dude, we can't miss this chance. Get it in. There we go, right in the middle. Oh, knockout shots. Knockout shots. That worked. Iva, you saved me. Thank you, Iva. Everything happened as I simulated it. All part so, of the simulation. Where's this porno mag? <laughs> of course. You idiot. There is no adult magazine. No. However. I know that your reaction time is up to 3.6 times faster when you are excited. <laughs> I simply took advantage of that behavior. What the hell? You might go and get one now. He deserved it after that traumatic experience. You're a grown man. Aren't you too old to be playing with toys? Shit. Where were he aiming anyway? Hey, coward. I see you. Show your face. You gonna come out so? I know you. I know you too, so is Tajima.
All right then, so. That's. Sejima, so. Congressman. Why is he here? What is this guy doing here? Mama? About Shoko. <sighs> what do you know? Well, I guess there's no point hiding in now. There isn't. I lied earlier. When I said I didn't know her. I thought so. You and the Kumakuras were a part of the fraud scheme Shoko was organizing. Yep. Whenever any wise-ass investors gave her trouble, we handled it. Exactly as, as I suspected. Shoko was affiliated with the Kumakuras. So what do you know about Renju then? I've been looking after that guy since high school. What do you mean looking after? It was the usual stuff. I had him help me with a lot of work. But now, it's kind of the opposite, you know? It's got to change out at some point. From him. You well, were. We were. Now that he's dead, though. What work did he have you do? Eh, the usual. Yeah? If Talon at his office was causing trouble or something. You ever get into any disputes with Renju doing this work? No way. He paid good money. Fair enough. I've never even gotten into an argument with the guy. About Rowan. I heard that the former head of the Kumakuras committed suicide last year. Yeah? Yeah. What's it to you? Nothing at all. I just want to talk about it. You did? Is that strange? Rohan was my about? older brother. He was my big brother in this organization, and my blood brother. Blood brothers. Six years ago, he, uh... He got sick in the head. He got sent to a special hospital. And naturally, because I'm his brother and next in line, I was the successor. You look, how did someone, the absolute unit, go to someone who looks like they should be part of two of the five lives? That's all I'm gonna say. You wanna know more? Hire a private eye. Well, where were you Us yesterday? The Kumakuras are a branch of the Ujisaki family. Yeah. The Ujisaki family runs a yearly golf tournament. Mandatory attendance. We were all at the tournament those days. We only got back this morning. You've been asked a hotel. They'll tell you. Date, I did some research. And? The hotel's record of guests does list the Kumakura members. They were also seen on several surveillance cameras. It is not possible that any of the Kumakuras could have killed Shoko. That rules out all of them then. Moma. As for you, so Sejima. Why are you here? I've had a relationship with the Kumakura since back when Rohan was running things. I had business nearby, so I stopped here for a visit. Whatever conspiracy theory you're imagining in your head, you can forget it. This is strictly business. So why the hell are you hiding in the... It's strictly cupboard? business? A congressman meeting with Yakuza? How are you gonna spin that? It's true. I imagine my public image will be dragged through the mud. But we haven't done anything illegal. If you want to accuse me of such wrongdoing, then by all means. I just happen to think such gossip is better suited for tabloids. Fair, fair point on that one, I have to give him credit for that. So where were you yesterday, so? I went to work, then went home. So, you have no alibi? Huh? No, I always have my bodyguards near me. If you want to, you can ask them. So where are they now? Bodyguard testimony can be unreliable. There is a possibility that they would lie to protect Mr. Sejima. That's what they're paid to do, so I think so too. I agree. I can't trust that. About Renju. The president of Lemniscate? Yep. We aren't friends. But I did meet him a few times through work. Yeah? What work were you doing to meet up with the head of an entertainment company? It was just some party hosted by some company or other. It's not unusual. 
it sounds it. Events with those uptight stuffed shirts can be rather dull. So they have some young women from an entertainment office attend. Ah, okay. So I anyway, is there. we only saw each other a few times. I don't even remember what we spoke about. How are you doing there? Oh, I can't talk to either of them too. About Shoko then. The victim prior to Renju? Yes. I believe Moma introduced me to her. Introduced? What did you do, Mama? We were just having drinks. Shoko stopped by to say hello. As you do. Right. We didn't talk about anything. Sure you did, but okay. You're trying to give me the runaround. Indeed. Date, I have determined that these individuals have nothing further to add. Even if they are involved, they will not volunteer any more information. And why would we they? We need solid evidence to move forward with the investigation. You're right. At the moment, Ota presents our best opportunity for finding leads. Should we go to Lemniscate? Yeah, let's go. MoMA, Congressman Sejima, I think I'm gonna call it a day. I'll come back soon. We'll swap drinking stories. You serious? Yep. Hmm. Let's nice go and on. happy. Roger. When next? Lemnir's Gate. I would have thought Oates would have been at his house, but apparently not. It's pretty late in the day after all. Apparently. This is all really suspicious. What is? Everything. Congressman Sejima and the Kumakuras. There's definitely something going on there. Obviously, he won't be hiding if there wasn't. I agree. But I am not sure it is linked to the new Cyclops serial killings. Not yet, anyway. We need to do further investigation. But that, on the journey there, is where I'm going to leave things for today. So if you enjoyed us finally having a conversation with Mizuki and getting somewhere with So this time around, then leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe if you're new, hit the notification bell, check out any future videos, if you give me a follow on Twitter and Instagram, that would be much appreciated, link in the description down below. And get subscribed to so our new videos on a Monday and Friday, but definitely Wednesdays if I can, and select Saturdays for Formula 1 and Formula 2. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all when we go meet Ota at Lemnisgate, hopefully next time.